Early to the line on third down and short. Edwards Elair breaks through into Rebel territory and down with a first down at the Old Borough and Edwards Elair. Immense in the win at Alabama last week. They shared Offensive Player of the Week award in the SEC. On target, Jamar Chase. He got planted, but it's a first down. Knows where he wants to go with the ball the majority of the time. 22-year-old transfer from Ohio State eluded the rush. Lofts it deep for a touchdown. Jamar Chase. This game continues. They handled the opening possession very well. John Rice Plumley, freshman quarterback, throws on the move. On target to their leading receiver, Elijah Moore. And he's across midfield and battles his way to the LSU 45. 777 rushing yards this season. And right on cue, here he comes again inside the 30, out of bounds. Most teams are passing down, not necessarily for Ole Miss. Plumley Chase looking for somebody, has a man, but looks to be out of bounds, and it is. Elijah Moore couldn't catch it. Season from the left hash mark. A 38-yard field goal try is off the right upright and no good. Burrow four out of five for 60 yards on the opening drive. Throws that one in the flat to Justin Jefferson. Back, who's excellent out of the backfield. Clyde Edwards Elia delivers a stiff arm from Kedron Smith. Just shoved him away. I think that is an apt comparison. Looks like Ole Miss was lined up offside there. No flag. It doesn't matter as Edwards Elair has a first down inside the 40 of Ole Miss. 4K game of the week. Third down and three for Burrow and the Tigers. Trouble at the junction. Sam Williams. It's a 48 yard try. It would match his longest, and it is no good. Just wide right for LSU. They've run eight first down plays. They've gained 88 yards. They'll add to that total. Now the ball fumbled by Thaddeus Moss. And it looks like he got it back. Than anyone in college football. Ty Davis Price, the running back. That one is on target between the numbers to Terrace Marshall. That Ogeron brought to, to the staff. Three minutes to go in the quarter. Burrow on the move, on target. And Moss lunges for the first down. LSU second in the country in pass offense. And Ole Miss 117th in pass defense. Here's Jamar Chase, has a first down. They can't get him on the ground. And hits the crossing chase. And it's a touchdown for Ty Davis Price. Forgeron last night and Dave Aranda, the defensive coordinator, they both seem confident in their team's ability to stop the run. And they stop it there. Jacoby Stevens came in completing 79% of his passes, and now he is 14 for 16 tonight. Jamar Chase out near midfield. And ended up transferring to Nebraska. I, I had a chance to visit with him today before the game over in the Grove. Burrow throws Jamar Chase wide open. Touchdown. Eight in three years with a degree in consumer and family financial services. His throw on target. Racy McMath backing up JT Barrett. Fakes the handoff. Wow. And that's the part of his game that, that doesn't get as much notice. He doesn't run it a lot. He could be the number one pick in the draft in the NFL next year. Justin Jefferson will win that race. Touchdown, LSU. He handed it off. Great speed Jay right here. Ely. He's a big playmaker, and he's making a big play. All the way down to the 25-yard line of LSU. Scored. He gave up 28 points in the second half. Gave up a long punt return. John Rice Plumley Never had offense like this. They've had great defense. Haven't had this kind of offense. Plumley showing that rushing ability. And about six yards of the ball. Plumley keeps it. That's a touchdown and a goal to go situation. And the Rebels are on the board with 540 to go in the half for the season. Joe Burrow and the Tigers from their own 40. 
Another completion. 14 in a row. Jamar Chase, five yard line. Burrow, such great feel in so many aspects. Runs out of bounds and then gets belted on a late hit by Lakia Henry, who will be flagged for that one. This one is getting that way itself. Blitz off the corner. He got it off to Edwards Elair. He's inside the 10. I'd like that if I was an LSU fan. He's in trouble. He'll be sacked. Back outside the 15-yard line. Sam Williams, the first man there. And the kick is good. Pretty over 300 yards, and he just makes it look easy. 319 for the half. Ole Miss ball to begin the second half, and a big gainer. Just play a pass completion for good yardage. John Rice Plumley continues at quarterback. He takes off running. He's going to take off to the end zone. Two plays and a touchdown for Ole Miss in just 31 seconds. Uh, his first start of his career, she was cheering for both teams. <laughs> yeah, sitting in the Alabama cheering section, but had a pin with his picture on it. Four to miles play. All right, thank you, Coach. Go Tigers. A little change in that plan, at least for the moment. Burrow runs over the umpire, and it gets tackled after a 15-yard game. Defense has had, and Ole Miss has demonstrated the ability to go up and down the field here tonight. Two touchdowns already and a missed field goal. This is not a good plan against Clyde Edwards-Hilaire, their key receiver. Edwards-Hilaire was widest to the left. They work inside to Jefferson, and he has the first down. It's a pass, and Edwards Elair does get the first down. Line. Mike McIntyre brought a blitz. Looked like one of the blitzers had his face mask grabbed. There is a flag down, and the pass incomplete for Thaddeus Moss. A three score game. 27 yard attempt for Cade York. One for two tonight. He's two for three tonight. His loss now, and Alabama was still very much in the playoff picture with their record. And They're about to go over 300 yards of offense and not yet midway through the third Look quarter. Out. Here goes Plumley again. Plumley running away from the LSU defense. Another touchdown for the freshman. Down two point conversion could tie. Design run for Plumley. Lunging and gets there for the two. So any thoughts of taking Burrow out of the game? Yeah. Certainly not in the head of the coach anymore. Edwards Elair, nifty run on first down. Pressured again. Got it off and has a man. Justin Jefferson. He may go. He does not go. Jalen Julius got him. LSU best in the country in the red zone. And one time this year did they not score. And they're in the red zone again, comfortably so, from the seven. Burrow, touchdown to Justin Jefferson. He'll be an outfielder and Mike Bianco's baseball team. Lumley throws an interception. Picked off by Kerry Vincent, who looks plenty healthy on this return. And he's chopped down inside the 30-yard line. Spread. They went and got Joe Brady from the New Orleans Saints. That one was almost picked off through the hands of Luke Knox just of his freshman season. Plenty of leg. Boy, did he boom that one with room to spare. They designed a run for him, and the Tigers were ready for it. Via six. 4 and 0 oh this season, including last week at Alabama. Burrow running out of field. Is that an interception? Is he I in think bounds? So. I think he was. Yes, he was. Kedron Smith. With hold that'll be turned down. There's the hold right there. The second one on Treyor, and that's just a play where Joe Burrow was a little hesitant whether to throw this away, step out of bounds. First, as you saw in the graphic in the fourth quarter, they fake the reverse. Plumley keeps it. Here he goes again. Touchdown, John Rice Plumley. I'd like to take credit for that, but it was Ben Ward in the truck who whispered that in my ear. Long throw up for grabs and intercepted by DeAndre Prince, the freshman, his second interception.
of his career. In for Kerry Vincent when he's not been on the field. Play of the game so far. Plumley too high. Over the head of Elijah Moore. They bring pressure right in his face. He got it off. Jamar Chase breaks free. They have angles on him. He made a great cut to the outside and scored. Oh, quite a bit. Dave Miranda's quote to us last night, there's Corral on target for a first down. Angles missed some tackles and uh, has been a responsible for some big plays. Corral on target, Elijah Moore weaves through that defense and a touchdown. Ranked in the top 10 at the time that they played. Ohio State well, we're in the top that. 25 still yes. entering today. They're both expected to be prohibitive favorites in each of their remaining games. Edwards Elair off to the races. Touchdown LSU, 49 yards. In a lot of places, but he's a humble guy. He's an LSU guy. He well, now just one game left for Ole Miss, the Egg Bowl. Try to finish it five and seven.